I'm Anil Kumar sharing with you test paper of my student and it's kind of important to understand why do we lose marks in a test paper. Here is a question on average rate of change trigonometric functions advanced functions grade 12 MHF4U. Let's discuss this question in details. The question here is what is the average rate of change of the function y equals to sin x minus 7 on the interval x is greater than or equal to pi and less than or equal to 4 pi by 3. Now as we know average rate of change is basically f of b minus f of a divided by b minus a right. So in this particular case it is going to be sine of The function is y equals to sine x minus 7. So sine of b is 4 pi by 3 for us. 4 pi by 3 minus 7. So that is f of b minus sine of pi minus 7, right? So that is f of a divided by 4 pi by 3 minus pi. So that is what it is. Now, you can always use your calculator to find these values and write down the answer. The important thing here is to use at least four decimal places when you are calculating the values. If you don't use four decimal places, you are not going to get accurate answer, right? So let's find out what is sine of 4 pi, which is second function divided by 3, bracket close, equals to let's do minus 7 also in this equals to let's write it in decimals so so that term is minus 7.8660 and then we have minus of sine pi sine pi you know is 0 so we'll get minus 7 itself so 7 divided by 4 pi by 3 minus pi so you could do take common denominator right so 4 pi minus 3 pi is pi so you get pi over 3 correct so that is what you have now we can add 7 to it so plus 7 in the numerator we'll times it by 3 and then we'll divide it by pi to calculate the answer so that gives us the value of minus 0 0.8 8, 2, 6, 9, 9. Correct? So that is the instant, that's the average rate of change for this particular function on the given interval, right? So our answer is that average rate of change for the function is minus 0 0.82. We can round this to 7. Okay, so that is how we can answer this question. Thank you and all the best.